What's my baby my tribe? <clears throat> Scorpio. I'm sorry. Scorpio. This is y'all weekly message. So Scorpio, um... Um, I'm sorry, Scorpio. So, you have you dealing with somebody that possibly you may see as a long term commitment. You might see as your wife, or you may anticipate marrying this person, or this person anticipates marrying you. So, this is someone that is realizing that you are everything that they ever hoped for, everything that they ever dreamed of, everything. Yeah, y'all could be dealing with Aquarius. Let's grow, child. Let's grow. Get your bracelets, get your healing bracelets, get them. I see what y'all got, Scorps. Scorps, Scorps, Scorpio. Bottom of the deck is love. Love. Somebody's a Leo. Or somebody cares for you. Somebody wants to have a forever love with you, Scorps. Somebody inspires you. We got four or eight on the clock. So four, four. Could be significant prosperity and nurture. Somebody definitely could be um, a water sign, such as yourself. You could be dealing with another water sign. Or are you dealing with somebody that you have a lot of feelings or emotions for? Somebody that you hold in high honor. You've been up late at night, can't sleep, being expired. Expired. Excuse me. Somebody could find out that they're pregnant. This is a forever love. Somebody has been um, projecting negative energy towards you. Somebody could be doing moon magic. Somebody is very intuitive. Somebody could live around water. Let's see. See, I split the deck. Ten of cups. So dealing with somebody that have a, a lot of love for you or you have a lot of love for them definitely a fire sign Aries, Leo, Sagittarius or you got this fire in your chart see somebody wants to lock you down somebody wants to make things official with you they do see you as their star they want to be a provider for you and this is someone that admires you this is someone that makes you smile or you make them smile you are their happiness somebody is brown skinned Somebody has been in their head. Somebody has been having headaches. Somebody, see, that's that moon. Somebody could definitely be doing moon magic. Somebody could also be a Pisces. Somebody wants to come and apologize to you for taking you for granted. Somebody wants to be um, rational with you. Somebody. They never want nobody like you. There's a decision that needs to be made between you and another woman. Somebody has to take a loss when it comes to a particular situation. But justice is being served. Somebody is coming with an apology. Or somebody's thinking about apologizing to you. 
See, I never wanted nobody but you. Somebody is having an ascension. There is a tower moment coming. And it does surround your happiness. Something is unexpectedly going to make you happy. You've been dealing with a liar. See, somebody is definitely thinking about reaching out to you. They could reach out to you at nighttime. It's 4 11 o'clock. Somebody could be an Aries. My phone is ringing, so that's confirmation. You give somebody anxiety, somebody going to reach out to you. Out the blue. There is success and victory. Somebody's about to be recognizing you. Are you about to be recognized? You are heavily protected when it comes to the divine. And there's that baby. There's that pregnancy. This is unconditional love. Somebody is going to take a risk. Definitely Aries vibe because they want to celebrate with you. They want to compromise. They want to come to some type of agreement after taking a loss. This is someone that had to make a decision between you and somebody else because somebody else was making them sad. Somebody else they were having a lot of arguments with. Somebody wears glasses. Somebody is a smoker. Somebody drives a white car. Y'all have truth and clarity coming after some type of compromise, after some type of tower moment. This about this uh, player, somebody that was in and out of your life. Somebody is sexually frustrated, and somebody is about to reach out to you, letting you know that they are separating from somebody else, and they want to work and invest with you because you are their destiny. Son, son, yeah. they got food on the stove. Uh -huh. That cane's on the stove for you, fucking fans. Still, watch me. Mm. Dilemma, confirm it. It was a third party situation. So heavy on the Scorpio. So my birthday could be in November. Could be a November Scorpio. Not likely. Somebody that ghosted you. And somebody's birthday is in the summer sign. Bottom of the deck. June. Aquarius, Virgo, Aquarius, Sagittarius, Aries, 10 and 12. You could be seeing a lot of 10s. 10, 10, 10. You could be seeing a lot of 1s. 1, 1, 1, one 2, 2, 2. But this is y'all. Message! I love y'all. Now order y'all bracelets.